guys, we're doing a pretty heavy song today, um, Hourglass, that's the name of this song, we're going to do it, and it's, I'm going to put it in drop C, I think, but right now we're in D, because I'm too lazy, and um, it's based off Your Betrayal by Bullet From Valentine, you can probably tell a little bit, but it's not copied, just put it out there, okay. Uh, um, what we're gonna start is the drummer is gonna start with that little riff. He's gonna do it twice, and then we're gonna pull a submerged, and we're gonna bring the volume up the third time. And we're gonna let that go twice, as usual, and then the next time we're gonna. That's what the rhythm's doing. The lead is gonna start doing this. Which is um just go between three and five. And then one and three. And three and five. One, three, five, seven. Yep, and I'm thinking. When we record, I'm going to do a harmony of that. I think after two of just doing the upper one, we're gonna do another one lower, so it gets it more high pitched and awesome and fat sounding. So yep, that's the intro, and the uh, the verse is like this. <laughs> And then three on the A and five on the E again. We just you do it twice. The next time you're gonna do the fifth. Five, seven, five, four. You do it twice. And yep. Then the pre-chorus. We change it up and put a pre chorus in. Is this. times pretty much same pattern just change it a little bit is open three five eight seven and you heard the little that's just a pitch scroll seven and then the second the last time you do nine so you got nine nine or not nine uh, eight 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 pick squeal, seven pick squeal. Now the chorus is a little different, and by the way, the rhythm and lead both do that. But the chorus is a little different. I based it kind of on Pirates of the Caribbean, so it's like. But I changed it. Don't worry. I made it like this, and they do the same thing. I'm not gonna do a little different thing. They're doing pretty much the same chord where you do all of them open, except for the G. The G is going to be on the second. So you're going to hit the three really quick and then slide to five. Seven, eight. That's what you do. So open three, five, 
seven, eight, eight, seven, five, three. That's pretty much it. You do it twice over four. I can't make up my mind yet. But yeah. And then you do the verse again, then you do the chorus, and then you do this. You hit you do the chorus and then you And while you let it go out, the drummer does that thing again. He does that while you let and then you start the intro again where the rhythm does and the lead does so you do that again for four beats no four measures my bad and then I think we're gonna do course so it's a pretty long song kind of and then the outro is like this and then I'll explain it and then we'll be done sweet so here's the outro So we're just doing the open three for two measures. Then we're going to do a diminished where you let the A and D open, but you bar the first to get that real nasty sounding chord. Then you're going to pick squeal on the third. And then you're going to do it again. You do, it. You, get, you do all of it four times, so four measures for all that. And then the song's over here. So, hope you guys enjoyed. No solo learn, which is easy on me and easy on you guys. Alright, and have a good day and have fun. See ya.